Hi everyone, um, it's Alia. Um, we're looking at further ways to try and save money as all my videos are, are about really trying to save as much money as possible. Um, and if you've got a, a power shower like mine, uh, it's pump driven and it delivers quite a lot of water, um, I decided maybe to have a look at that area. There's quite a number of things out there. You can change the head, um, 15 pounds, supposed to save you a lot of money on a shower head, which I haven't got yet, but I do plan to do so. Um, but also you can, you can get one of these um, off eBay for about three quid, uh, and it's supposed to um, reduce the flow and deliver it more evenly and aerate it and so forth. But I thought for the price, it's probably worth fitting. So um, give it a go, I to save a bit of money. Now it does say it must be fitted um, on the hose in there, okay and not on the shower head in there it doesn't go there it goes there so I'll just show you how to do it it's fairly easy oh, i'll just get my tools and show you um hang on a second now while i get my my uh, trusty pair of grips we need a pair of these okay um, just to unnip this this part here because it will be it will be nipped up a bit tight so just release it like so i'll put it down I'm sure about moving the camera around everybody but uh, there you go Okay, we need to take that off of there. Okay, there'll be a washer in there. Can you see it in there? We don't want to lose that. Okay, it should stay put in there. But um, I'll drop the hose down. It comes out when it's come out. So just be careful it's got to go back in, okay? Um, now we get our aerator device, and this is it. And obviously it can only go one way, and that's the female end on. So we put our washer in, inside this. It comes with, if it hasn't got a washer, you will need to buy one. Okay, that's got a washer with the thing, um, local plumbers, and pick yourself up a little washer and then screw him on there. Okay, now it doesn't need to be too tight really, uh, but we'll give him a little nip like that with the grips, okay? Just get a little tiny nip, that's it. Okay, and then we'll get our washer on the new one, on the old one I should say. Make sure your washer's back on here, okay, on the hose. Okay, I've got mine back in there now and um, screw it onto the aerating device, like so. So it's quite a quick, simple job, the camera there. And once again, you need a pair of footprints or a pair of grips just to nip it up slightly, okay? Just like that. And um, that should be the job now. Um, probably won't be able to tell much difference with the pressure as it is, but I'll turn it on just to see. You know, it looks like it could be a wee bit slower, but um, it'll need to be tried out properly just to see. So at that, I'm gonna try that out in the morning, have a shower, or perhaps even in five minutes, got a few fancy one now, um, and we'll see how it goes. But uh, nothing much lost um, for the sake of three quid worth a go. Um, but I'm gonna try changing the head as well later on for one of those energy saving ones, and uh, we'll give that a go as well. But for now, if you want to try one of these, so they're, they're only three quid off eBay, worth a go. Um, they're supposed to say 10%, but it's, the claims are always be exaggerated, so you know don't go on that too much. But anything we can save money uh, with our bills, that's what uh, Derrick and 33 is all about. So that's it from me. Thanks very much for watching all my videos, Derrick and 33. Thanks very much for watching.